This conference will now be recorded. Hi everyone, a very good evening to all. In this video, uh, I will explain the cycle counting indicator. We know that in physical inventory process, we have a process called cycle count indicator. Cycle counting along with uh, regular monthly counting are kind of a physical inventory processes. The cycle counting is one of the physical inventory processes. In this cycle counting, we can come to know that the material which needs to be counted for once in a year, once in um, six months, or once in a three months, a quarterly, or half yearly, or yearly, those kind of uh, segregation can be done by using the cycle counting indicator. Okay, for example, A, B, C indicator, A for yearly once, B for uh, half yearly, C for quarterly. Like that, we can segregate because uh, the very slow moving materials and uh, the materials which are not that much uh, having value, those kind of materials companies use it to do for uh, once in a year or once in half year. Okay, the materials, fast moving materials and the high value items. Okay, and uh, these kind of materials, they try to do the physical inventory monthly once or uh, quarterly once based on their requirement. Because if you calculate all the materials, it will take a lot of time. So they can uh, segregate the materials based on the cycle counting indicator. Okay, that, here the question is like the cycle counting indicator in the material master, is it at plant level or a client level or storage location level? Okay, let us see. So taking the material master, go to directly we will go to the plant data storage one view because where the material is stored. Okay. With the material cycle counting indicator data is stored. We go to plant data storage one and input my plant, my storage location. Okay. Here we have the cycle count physical in inventory indicator. Click on F1. And uh, here what I explained, physical inventory indicator for cycle counting indicates whether uh, the material subject to what kind of uh, cycle in, uh, counting, monthly count or uh, quarterly or yearly. Okay, let's our question, go to the technical details, technical information. And here you can see that the table is MERC and the field is ABC IN, ABC indicator. So here, uh, MERC, the table, MERC, what table it is? Let us check it. Slash OSC 16N, MERC. See, MERC is a plant data for material. So that the cycle counting, physical inventory cycle counting indicator of a material master is at plant level. So for each plant, you can have a multiple cycle counting indicator, but you cannot have a multiple cycle counting indicator for the storage location or else uh, for across all across all the plants, if you want to have a same indicator, yes, we can maintain the same indicator for all the plants. So cycle counting indicator of a material master is at plant level. It is stored in MERC. And if you want to get the cycle counting indicators of multiple materials, you can come to MERC table and pass your materials and your plant and execute to get the cycle counting indicator. This is the ABC indicator. Thanks for watching. Have a good evening. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to share if you like my videos. Have a good evening.